selection of 100% safe CBD pet products. Visit HempHouseChad.com or come see us in person. The Hemp House in North Shore, East Ridge, and Ottawa. I cannot think of a better way to enjoy a beautiful spring day in Chattanooga than having a chance to sit outside on the patio area with Charlotte Mabry of the Charlotte Mabry team talking real estate. Good to see you this Good morning. Good to see you as well. Thank you for letting me come out here today. Well, this is a great excuse to be outside. I'm isn't telling it? you what, a <laughs> lot of people who've been working from home yes. uh, this last year probably have been doing their own enjoyment like this, sitting out on their back. Absolutely, deck. when we missed it. <laughs> no doubt, Charlotte, there are people watching though today thinking, okay, that's what I'm wanting. I'm wanting a house with a patio that right. I can sit outside and enjoy. Talk a little bit about the whirlwind of this year real estate wise you told me it's something like 700 houses on correct the market. it's amazing back in the day uh, we would have roughly five or six thousand homes available for people to view a couple of years ago it got down to two to three thousand right now it's a little over 700 homes available and um, very frustrating if you're a buyer right now it's great if you're a seller it's tough as a buyer I think the market changed for a lot of reasons uh, we've had investors buy properties back 10 or 12 years ago. That took some inventory off the market, and those homes are being rented now instead of being sold. And we have a lot of people transferring here from out of town, so that takes up houses as well. And then because of COVID, everyone sat at home and said, you know, I like this fire pit, I like this space, but I don't, I don't have a, that's my house is not like that. I need something with a different floor plan. Mm -hmm. I need another office, I don't like this open space, whatever it might be. Right. And so that's driven everyone to go, wow, I need a new home. So you put all those things together and it just comes out as a very crowded market for buyers. It's very difficult. So talk a little bit though about um, what you also do with your team for the sellers because unless you are selling your home to then go move to a different state, where you're, you're in a pickle. <laughs> you're in a real pickle. And, right. and until you bought a few homes, you don't always realize the deep, deep, deep importance of how that contract is written. Correct. Right? So you as the agent, and having had the experience you have, know exactly how to phrase things to protect your client. Absolutely. And so that's the biggest scare, I guess, as it were right now, for people thinking of selling is, I really want a new house, but I, I don't know where I'm going to go and I can't find anything for sale right now for me to move to. So it's like having a parking lot that's all the parking places are full and there's a big line trying to get into the parking lot, but no one will move their car so anybody can move in or out of the parking lot. So we've devised a couple of opportunities where we can help our sellers go ahead and put their home on the market with a stipulation that they can stay and rent after closing or perhaps we can delay the closing there's definitely different options so that you can find your buyer get your buyer in place mm -hmm. and then go okay what do we do now we'll go find something but you've secured your buyer so it gives you a little better buying power when you do sell and right. move on because you've got your house under contract and you don't have to worry about losing that opportunity. It's hard uh, when you're a seller too because there's an awful lot you're dealing with, right? As, as the individual homeowner, you're saying goodbye perhaps to a house that you've lived in for a long time. You're sorting through, figuring out what you're gonna keep and what you're gonna get rid of, all of that type of a thing. Then it's one thing to get one or two offers. That's great. I mean, a house will absolutely sell in today's market. The trick is how do you get the most money and get the best offer and that's where an experienced agent comes into play mm -hmm. um, we can help our people sometimes the most money is not the best offer there may be some other terms like someone will let you stay after closing or someone's going to give you other opportunities you need to check that out first and maybe right. make that decision I guess it can also be tempted for the novice out there to think well if I can get any amount of money I'll price it high <laughs> you price it too high you don't have any people looking at it absolutely right? well there you will always get people looking at your home in today's market that's how quirky it is the real trick is if your buyer is going to get a loan that house needs to appraise for the sales price 
many properties that are sold today are not appraising for the sales price. So the buyer then has to make a decision, am I going to walk away from this property or am I going to make up the difference? Now we do see people agree to make up the difference, but is that really the smartest thing for someone to do in this market, mm -hmm. to pay more than a house appraises for? I, you know, that's a decision that a buyer has to make today because there's another buyer standing in the wings who will pay the difference, who perhaps has cash. Okay, uh, let's assume that you've got a seller who's also looking to still stay in Chattanooga and now become a buyer. In days of old, it would be, we'll think about putting our house on the market, let's go drive around, see what's available. Those days have come and gone, I guess. Correct. Um, but do if they come to you, let's say, and you had another client who was selling their house. Ah, there's there's the trick today, and that's really what's keeping the market moving any, any at all is we have people today, a whole list of off-market properties, as it were, where we know this person's getting ready to sell or this person's getting ready to buy. And so we're able to do some matchmaking behind the scenes. And that is the reason that houses are selling right now. It's a little different thing. If you've been used to going on the internet and looking for houses at this website or that website, Unfortunately, the houses that are really for sale today are not on those websites. They never make it. Mm -hmm. And so that's another reason that, you know, the consumer needs to be sure they're hooked up with a real estate professional that has that, those options. Okay, and then before I let you run, um, on the selling point, if you're going to sell and buy, if you've been in your home for 15 or 20 years, uh, the way you go about getting a mortgage and getting pre-qualified might be a little different than it was when you first did it. You want to have all those ducks in a row too, correct? That is a great question. You know, a couple of times in my career, I, a long, long time ago, I didn't ask those questions ahead of time. Hey, have you gone ahead and gotten pre-approved for your own mortgage? And so in today's market, you for sure want to be in knowledge that you can qualify for another mortgage because if you put your house on the market, it will be sold and you need to be sure that you can still qualify. And it is much more difficult to obtain a loan today than it was 10 or 15 years ago. That's a good thing. There are very few foreclosures in the market as a result. However, people that qualified for loans back then may not be able to qualify for loans today. Okay, so I'm gonna let you have the final word, kind of, <laughs> because she mentioned the foreclosures. Uh, Charlotte very much is tuned in to the community and she's got a knowledge base that the rest of us might not have. So tomorrow on the show, stick around, because if you are someone who maybe is in jeopardy of losing your home, maybe you had a COVID uh, loss of income or something, she has some ideas for things that can help you there as well. So tomorrow, she and I will sit out here again and talk about that. In the meantime today, if you're looking to sell your house or you're looking to buy a house, don't think twice about contacting her at the Charlotte Mabry team. Their phone number and website right there on your screen. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you so much. I appreciate the opportunity. Hey, you don't have to go anywhere. Let's just sit here all day, okay? You got a deal. <laughs> the filet of fish is completed with a half slice of cheese. Is its bun half empty or half full?